Teaching moment. One thing Val does is make everything a teaching moment. And I show you, that's the love. I show you my story. Nobody else can tell my story but me. People talk about minding their business. Well, why are you minding mine? I mean, I'm just being me. And some of you think I should be less than you. You know who you are, the ones who try to copy me and sing your Simpson stands, but they can't even stand with me. They can't even stand in truth, so how can they stand with me? They can't even stand in their own light, in their own self, so they want to be copies. Who wants to be a copy? I don't, why would I want to be a copy? I mean, I can see where some people want to be a copy because maybe your life's not all that, but my life is great. Even when it looks like crap, I am ruling my day and my night too. You know what? What would a real goddess do for me? Anyway, true to myself. So, this is a learning and a teaching moment, okay? Always incognito. God might be incognito today. No, but incognito is a group that I love to play. I used to play them all the time on Soul School Cafe. Trust me, they made the cut. Bluey's doing well. No matter what, I could never hate on that because the energy, the music that literally inspires you, like I don't really give a damn what people do in their personal life unless it's like horribly, horribly or you kill somebody just for a view, then I would really have issues with you. You know what I mean? But anyway, yeah, am I still on this coffee thing? Okay, but anyway, no, but you know, maybe it's the juice, maybe it's me. I've actually been outside in nature getting my own therapy, but this is what I know. So the mosquitoes were biting my, I mean, they were biting me. They were biting these little blood sucking predators that I cannot stand, but they make good food for dragonflies. Okay, so that's their purpose. I always remember mosquitoes are food for dragonflies, and I love myself some dragonflies, but here's the deal. After I did on my walk and did all of that, you know, and I'm like itching, I got hives. I mean, I got hives everywhere. Listen, I've got Benadryl. I've got something that, uh, if I got anxiety, which is really like a type of a Benadryl light that I can take that, but it's still going to kind of put me to sleep. But I'm resting, so it's okay. Because, you know, I didn't do what I had to do for my walking therapy. Because, you know what, just one step. You got. You can't be mad. My team said, don't overdo. And uh, it's like nature made sure I didn't overdo. So even mommy said, too, yeah, we got you. But we're not going to let you overdo. We're not going to let you overdo. So anyway, go ahead to the other incognito song you like. Nope, that's not it. Is that it? Yeah. So, might as well make this a whole incognito uh, uh, event. So School, so School Cafe Live Session 2. You know, what good music can do. But anyway, yeah, a good thing is good vibes. What can good vibes do? Because everything I do is a teaching moment, see? But they say I'm the bad guy. I haven't asked you to like, subscribe, or donate or get them numbers up or none of that. And I haven't clapped my ass or my legs. <laughs> oh, they bad. Y'all begging for views. I really just don't give a fuck. She is so Pisces. Yes, I'm the Pisces. That girl. I'm that kid. Anyway, uh, whew, lots of things going on. So, yeah, so I'm not supposed to overdo some Mother Nature. I, I see the wind. I feel the wind blowing. The wind is literally co signing me in everything I do. You have digital things confirm you, but I have actual nature in G-O-D-D-E-S-S. -S. Who confirms me? Who might I be? I don't know. I'm still learning me. But yeah, you know me. I got a word for the collective. Okay. And what word would that be? <laughs> and she does this shit so easily. And see, that's what it said. Is she a lead with the devil? She does sell her soul to the devil. Do I look like somebody that would sell my soul to the devil? You look at somebody with real talent. You look at a hoe clapping their ass and she said, I'm one of God's chosen. Which God would that be? What daddy would that be? My daddy. My daddy. Your daddy's not my daddy, bitch. You will never do me. If you took that personally, it was opposed to, okay? Oh my gosh. Is the moon still in Virgo? Because if it is in Virgo, we're analyzing everything, okay, today because I am at the top of the class. You said you wanted a master class, but some of you don't have no class at all. It is so sad when you can't even do basic math and you're so god darn basic. See, I curved the word, mother. Mommy says, remember, you're, 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 woo-woo-woo, 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 woo-woo-woo. Bars, 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 stars, 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 stars. These bitches who speaking from their car. But I'm speaking from my car too, so how can I hate on you? And that's the thing, so how can you hate on me? In reality, what about your story or are you born? Pause. Oh my God, it's what I could say. I think it would be hilarious and it's satire, it's comedy today. 
Pisces? Is this the way we're going to do it? Saturn and Pisces? It's like, okay, I can say something totally hilarious. People are kind of hurting today because I guess a lot of things are going on. I don't know what's going on. I mean, but okay, but back to my story though. As far as the, uh, and this is a bigger story. This is the microcosm to the macrocosm. Look that word up if you don't know what that is. Anyway, microcosm and macrocosm. So this story, so these little skeeters, you know, which, which I'm not supposed to be overdoing and Mother Nature says, you know what, go back home and rest. You are really challenging yourself. I mean, really, you don't have to do all this that you do. You know you're hurting. I mean, you know you. You're healthier than most. At your age, you're healthier than possibly, probably everybody your age. But still, you got some things going on and you need to rest. You're in pain. I mean, my back is like super crazy. But it's I'm not feeling a thing right now because maybe it's the music. Maybe it's just my therapy. Maybe it's when you're doing stuff you really like, you really don't feel the pain and you don't need all this extra other stuff. You all like to take these shots for the pain and shit like that. And I'm like... Number one, I don't do needles like that, and I don't. All drugs are not good drugs. Not even the ones that you think of as as in. in you know, like, why am I telling you? I'm doing this for free, and ain't nobody paying me. Who's supporting me? Which one of these zaddies and maddies do I have on my team? Oh, I'm supposed to come by you, and I'm supposed to come see you. I'm supposed to open my legs up to you. You drinking, stinking scum. Okay, what was that? Why did that move? Why did that move? Did the, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Did I get too personal with somebody? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Looks like I heard the nerve. Maybe it's time for you heard the word from me. I'm doing me. My creativity. Just who is she? Mm -hmm. Let it be. Here comes a black car right in past me. They don't know what they see, but I'm just doing my poetry. A little bit of comedy, too, and satire. It's all in view. Oh, man, people just act like they mean. I'm her. I'm the divine feminine, too. What type of divine feminine would that be? If that's what the divine feminine in your collective looks like, then good. You stick with that. You stay in your lane because you're not on my plane. And trust me, I'm not playing. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm just being me, honestly. I think we it should be obvious. Anyway, so uh, the story, though, today, the story for today is that, you know what? After I went walking everything and got ate up and thought I'm going to literally have to take some Benadryl or some shit or one of the, you know, the, the thing that I take for the anxiety, which is Benadryl-like. But I went and got some food. You know, food makes me feel some kind of way, especially if it's good food. And I didn't think about it anymore because I was in my happy place. And then I started, you know, and I got the food and I'm happy. And the music changed and everything. And I put the stuff and I'm like, you know, realizing I'm in my happy zone right now. And I don't feel anything. And even the whelps, because I'm telling you, the whelps were like super crazy big. And I don't even hardly see them now, which means, uh, oh, there's one right there. But it's really a lot of mental shit. I'm not saying that there's that these things don't affect your body. Oh, they really, really, really do. But a lot of it's is mental. This your real gurus, your real gurus, not your fake ones, not the fake ones. You you hear them talk, but you don't see their walk. But you actually see my walk because you saw me getting my ass paid up uh, <laughs> with these skeeters. But now I know I see the whelps going down. And I just know in days of old, I had to take a Benadryl. I mean, it was like obvious. It was like obviously the next move. I would have to take a pill to bring some of this stuff down. But I started thinking about being happy and my food and my food made me happy and I played some incognito and the music made me happy and I was kind of staying in my happy and it's still there. It's still there but I don't feel it as much as I do. And when you do that and your body starts to be aware, your body, your body's own healing powers kick in. They really do. And it's starting to counteract the poison. Because as long as you're scratching and you're thinking about it, you're thinking about it. So it's like you're thinking about some pain and you're always thinking about pain. And that's why you stay the same because you're always thinking about the pain. You're not doing, you're not changing up. You're not changing up your energy. You're stuck in that pain synergy. And it's, and, and that's a dis-energy. So I got into my happy. And even though I'm still been bit by skeeters and stuff like that, I replaced that with good food, good vibes, good music. And I'm just doing what I do. This is my therapy. This is my process. This is my story. How Val Jones takes a problem and turns it into a teaching moment. Dun, dun, dun. I always come too early. <laughs> it's that 
too. I always do that. I really do. Oh my gosh. Can you wait for the cue, Val? Come on. Patience is a value. I'm working on it. Honestly. Now we're ready for this song. Here we go. Go, Gabriel. Go. Blow that horn, V. Up to do with me and my poetry. I'm a poet and I know it. So mote that be. The green old tarot. Naturally the O. O, O, O. The range manger show. Here we go. All in my flow. I'm minding my business, mind yours. Peace.